let's get started guys with how I decided to rock these camouflage pants by, by the brand Sanctuary for a daytime and a more dressy type of evening time look, okay? I don't think a lot of folks think, oh yeah, let me wear camouflage pants to go out in, but I feel like they are like the new denim. You know, you can't go wrong with, with army fatigue, camouflage, you know, it's fun, it's funky, it's contemporary, and I figured why not give you guys a couple of different looks with this to make your life a little bit easier, okay? So let's get started. So I'm gonna add a bold type of belt. It's not too bold, but it's kind of, you know, the, the design, the stud here is it's pretty bold, but the belt itself is on the thinner side as far as width. So I'm gonna add this because I felt like it would be a nice touch um, with this turtleneck. And um, this turtleneck is by Free People, okay? And I actually made this little slit here myself for fun. So it goes all the way up on the neck and it's cropped, okay? Totally cute, totally chic, okay? And it's, um like short sleeve and I just thought this was like cozy chill and uh, something that you could wear for every day okay so this is the everyday type of daytime look with these cargo pants so let's put the belt on to add some earrings let me add these silver hoop earrings goes really well with the stud in the belt okay so let's and I'm gonna throw on these Nine West boots. They're like pretty standard high heel boots, okay, with, with, with a pointy toe. Uh, very standard. I feel like it's very everyday. You can dress it up, you can dress it down. But it's pretty much like an everyday type of, of shoe, okay? So let me put this on. Boots, okay. Okay, and I'm going to add um, something to make this look a little bit more relaxed so that it doesn't look too dressy casual, okay? I have this opening ceremony cap with this black and white stitching here. Let's put it on. Like I'm trying to give, I'm trying to give chill, but also give, you know, I put some effort into my outfit, okay? And I grabbed this MM6 tote, Japanese tote bag in pink. I figured it would make the purple pop in the top and just kind of seal in the look. Something a little unexpected with the pink, okay? So this is like the more daytime look. And I love these pants because they have pockets here. They have pockets here on the side. And this is the daytime look with these cargo pants, okay? Now let me give you guys the nighttime look, all right? I'm going to make this quick. I'll keep it chic, right? And... And this is something that you can wear out with your girlfriends. You know, sometimes you don't want to wear something tight. And I know they have like loose fit jeans right now, so you have options. But for me, I like a good type of cargo pant. Hey guys, so this is the next day. Actually, two days later, um, I'm doing the, the dressier look for the camouflage pants, okay? I wasn't feeling that well the other night, so I had to just like call it quits. And I said, you know what? I'll just continue the video on a day that I'm feeling much better. My stomach was a little upset and um, I didn't want to like work and have you guys see me not feeling my best. So I said, okay, I'll do it, you know, in the week. So this is the other look. This is the dressier type of look for the camouflage pants okay so let me show you how I decided to style this I put on this kind of strappy type of crisscross top <laughs> um I've had this for a little while and I don't really wear it that much but I figured 
this would be a really good opportunity to rock this. So let me show you how I'm going to put on my heart-shaped earrings here um, to give this a, a, a you know, like a, 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 fa a type of like feminine feel to add some, I guess, added femininity to it. And, um, but feminine could be, you know, soft. It could be masculine. It's like a mixture of things, but... Um, I guess with the heart shape, I'm gonna add a little dainty, okay? So, along with the heart shape earrings, I'm always also gonna add uh, this tweed type of Chanel, Chanel mock type of sweater. Um, it's not really a tweed jacket, it's a tweed sweater which resembles a jacket. So, I figured I would mix the prints here, the camouflage print and then the tweet print together, you know, with these beautiful colors, this pink and brown, a little bit of white blended here in this sweater, uh, this beautiful sweater top that I got from Bloomingdale's a little while back. And um, I'm going to, like I said, add some daintiness to this look which is a little different from what I did in the daytime look for this, okay? So, I'm going a little all out here, okay, with the pink shoes, but I saw this somewhere online, and I thought this was so freaking cool, and, and then I looked in my closet, and I was like, oh, I have some similar items that I can rock, and so here it is, and I usually don't think to wear pumps, or colorful pumps with with camouflage pants, but why not? I, th I think it's a whimsical type of feel, and it's so me. It has like this quirky feel to it, which is so me, and I'm going to add a couple more things. I'm going to just add this Balenciaga bag here, vintage Balenciaga. And some Tom Ford Sunnies, these round eye sunnies. Like I said, I want to keep it feminine, dainty, but with the army fatigue pants, I feel like it gives a little masculine edge to the mix, which I think is super fun. And I'm not wearing a belt, I'm just gonna let the pants just hang down. Real quick, guys, before I head out to work, I just want to say that we are in control. This is, this is the self-care portion of this video, okay? I just want to say real quick that we are in control of how our day goes. We are in control of how much joy we choose to let in. And for me, throughout the week, you know, with a busy schedule and dealing with a lot of emotions at work, uh, I, I really do turn to my happy tools, the tools, the things that make me feel like myself, like cooking, you know, watching a funny show, um, you know, just kicking my feet up, doing my nails, you know, reading a book, all sorts of things, you know, going on social media <laughs> and vibing with you guys. These little things just, just keep me going, keep me motivated, um, you know, staying creative. It's so great to have that outlet. And I feel like because of my creative outlet, I have this long lasting tool that I could always turn to, you know, when, when I need to pull it out of my toolbox to keep me, Tamara Nicola, feeling like myself, you know, feeling present in the here, in the now. So I feel like we get to choose how we want our day to go, you know, despite some of the harshness that comes with life, you know, we, we don't have to dwell in the negatives. We can choose to reach for the positives and kind of push the negatives down under when we, as much as we can, right? To, to let the light in, right? To let the brightness out, okay? So recently, I lost my job the other day. Um, unfortunately, I was not happy there. I was not using my skill set. So the universe made it so, you know, I didn't have to work there anymore. And I was so worried, you know, but I, I, I dug in and stuck to what I believed in, which was I'm good at what I do and I am good to others and I will find something that suits me, you know, in due time as the universe sees fit. And I kid you not, I was like reaching out to my tools to kind of help me along and to keep me 
above waters, right? Without going into like a slight depression. And I kid you not, the next day I found a job. The next day a client reached out to me and was like, um, you know, I, would you like to come back <laughs> to us? You know, we miss you so much. And um, it, it, it was amazing. It was nice to be able to lean on my faith, lean on my sense of joy, just knowing, just believing, just knowing that I deserve what this life has to offer. I deserve all of it, right? Don't shortchange me. <laughs> all right, and with that, guys, I love to love you. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope this was helpful to you. And I will see you again here on a Monday in the next video. I love to love you. Mwah.